Hello traders, this is Ken Calhoun, Day Trading University, Swing Trading University and Trade Mastery. Hey, just wanted to give you a quick heads up on how to download our videos the right way. And this is mainly designed for those of you who are new to downloading videos on the internet. Uh, one of the things that really helps is to make sure that you right click, not left click, but right click on the link. And in Firefox, what you do is right click and then choose Save Link As. And there you left click on the save link as. So it's right click here. That'll open up this dialog box. Then left click on where it says save link as. Just to be crystal clear, on a mouse, the right button is over here where I'm showing you. So that's what you click right there. Do not click on the left. Do not click on the left on the link. Instead, click on that right button and then choose save link or save target as. As soon as you do so, it will then open up your Windows Explorer and prompt you where to save your video. I would go to your computer, left click on that, and then click on somewhere on your C drive to uh, choose a location to download the video to. That makes it easy for you to save the videos and keep them for future reference. Or in Firefox, if you left click on the link, it will choose either open with or save file as and you can easily just click save file and click OK and that will also prompt you for where to save it using Windows File Explorer. Either way as soon as you start the download it will at that point show you where it's downloading. It'll display the progress of the download. Now wait until the first video is completely downloaded before you download a second video. That's important because these are very large files and you want to download these as quickly as you can one at a time. In fact, if you left click on that icon, it'll show you how much time is remaining and the rest of it. So it's a really handy way to instantly see what's downloading. And once this is filled up and it's completely downloaded that video to your hard drive, then and only then, once it's complete, uh, do you click on the second link and again right click save link as in Firefox and that'll prompt you to save your second video and so forth and so on. When downloading with Internet Explorer this process is very similar. You just go to the download page, right click on the link and in Explorer you choose save target as and then you just left click on that. So in IE, Internet Explorer, you right click on the link, left click on where it says save target as, and then it'll prompt you for a location uh, on your hard drive just as the previous one did with Firefox. In Internet Explorer, once you click it, it will also say do you want to open or save that video file? And in that case, you just click, left click on where it says save, and it will prompt you for a location on your hard drive. You can choose that and choose Save As. And that will open up a Internet Explorer window as well and you can choose where on your hard drive, on your C drive, to download that video file to. When using Google Chrome, the same process is used. You go through, go to the download link, right click on that, not left click, right click on the link, and then left click on where it says Save Link As. And that will prompt you for where to save the video file on your hard drive. So that's it. Downloading Day Trading University videos is relatively straightforward. You just right click on the link and choose Save Link As or Save Target As, depending on which browser you're using. Also, make sure to back up your video file on a second location, such as a external hard drive or burn it to a DVD or a flash USB card or some other external source so that you've got a backup in case your main hard drive fails at some point you'll have a safe backup somewhere because we do not re-upload these videos. They're online to conserve bandwidth and also for administrative and security purposes. We only keep the videos online for up to several days, maybe a week or so after each of the main events. So please be sure to download your video and check it by left clicking on it uh, from within your file Windows Explorer and make sure that you can watch it using Windows Media Player or similar. Anyway, best wishes for success and I'll see you in one of our upcoming events.